we are going to do weaving with this beautiful pom prom that I got from my backyard. And you can do it with the dried out ones too. You probably have to just um, wet them down to make them a little bit more pliable. But what I'm going to do is I'm gonna begin by just taking off one side of the leaves with a pair of scissors. And I'm gonna leave the other side with the leaves attached to the stem. And this is going to be my warp and these are going to be my weft. Okay, so I've just taped the edges down to my table just so that it doesn't move on me. But you can see I have one, two, three, four, five, six of these leaves hanging. You can do more or you could do less. And then the ones that I cut off are going to weave over, under, over, under each of these. So this would be considered the warp this would be considered the weft. So I'm going to take it, and it doesn't matter what side you use, and I'm going to go over the first one, under, over, under, over, under. And when I get across, it's important that you push it all the way to the top, and eventually this will straighten out on its own. So now, the next thing you need to remember is that every other weft that you put through has to do the opposite of the last one. So if this one went over this leaf, then this one needs to begin going under. So now I'm gonna go under, over, under, over, under, over, until I get all the way across. And once I get all the way across, I need to make sure that I push this all the way up so that it's nice and tight. Now it's time for the next one. So this one and this one has a little tear in it, but that's okay, is under. So now I'm gonna go over, over, and then under, over, under, over, under. And you keep doing that until you get all the way to the bottom. take a little break here and show you once you think you're finished you need to stop and you need to push and push all the way until they're nice and snuggled in together this is what's going to create a really nice tight weaving that'll hold together forever so I thought I was pretty far down but now that I look at this I still have plenty to go so every once in a while, just stop. Make sure you're pushing everything together so everything stays nice and snuggled in and tight. So I'm gonna continue going. And now I have finished it. So at the very, very bottom, I just took it and I just did like a little braid at the bottom and I put a little tie around the bottom and now I can hang it up.